I shot with Black Gina through a makeup artist. And then I got uh, Angela Simmons and Yo Gotti through a uh, clothing stylist. Those are big mm -hmm. names, man. You don't ask for autographs? Good workflow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you don't ask for a feature? <laughs> Yo Gotti, bro. I would have used that. Hey, here's my mixtape. Hey, you listen to hip hop? <laughs> He's like, uh, what? <laughs>。Welcome back to another episode of Careful Boys. This is a continuation episode uh, where Joseph was telling us about his time in the military service, specifically the U.S. Marines. Uh, ten years in the service. What made you decide that ten was seven surgeries? Yeah, he, he hit it right on. The what dot. is it? What? Oh, seven surgeries? Really? That's, seven surgeries? That's what the. Uh, that's the reason why. You're like this shit's beat me up. Oh. Yeah, I actually had a talk with my dad, and uh, he was like, "Man, you gotta think about your shelf life." So uh, that's kind of one of the big factors, and uh, photography kind of like had fell in my lap during the time, like right as I was about to get out, I was kind of just getting good with photography and stuff like that. So uh, when I got promoted to staff sergeant, <clears throat> and they moved me to North Carolina, that's where I kind of like started my whole like oh. photography venture. I was traveling like three hours just to do a free photo shoot so I can like build my skills out and stuff like that. And then I met my best friend, Trevor. He's uh, the one that took me in and was like, yo, if you ever need a place to stay while you're in Wilmington, like you could just stay at my house. And then so on the weekends, he let me, I'd go over there on Fridays. He let me stay at his house from Friday to Sunday. And then I'd come nice back guy. instead of just <laughs> driving every single day, you yeah. know, freaking three hours just to go do a shoot. So. And you got, uh, how did you get so good at photography? Was it just on your own, just trying Oh, uh, yeah, YouTube University. Yeah. YouTube University, <laughs> so. Uh, Military pays for that one too, huh? <laughs> yeah, yeah, they do. They, I feel like they pay for everything now. They just throw money at you, you know? I'm trying to get I'm in, signing up. Uh, I should have, bro. I'm trying to get on those, uh, you see those Instagram ads where it says like, oh, if you've drank in the water from Camp Lejeune and oh. stuff like that, like. The payouts or something? Are those like clash action lawsuits or something? Uh, I think I think they are. Whoa! I think they are. They, they, like I had a lady actually call me. She was like, "Hey, um, I hear that you were in the military. Are you, um, yeah, are you inquiring about you know such and such?" And I was like, uh, "Yeah, I had called about it, but I didn't think I was, you know, eligible for oh. anything like that." And then so they ran like my history and they're like, oh, it's only for like these, this date and this date. So like, yeah, if you're at the base from like this date to this date and you were doing this, they've been paying people out. That's cool. I don't want people to call me to tell me that they want to give me money. I know, I wish I was on that list. Yeah. <laughs> Without any of the complications from whatever yeah. I drank. Exactly. exactly. I don't want that at all. I don't want that. No, yeah. I want money. Yeah. <laughs> I got seven dollars from Toyota from a class action lawsuit. It just showed up in the mail. Because the airbags or what? I don't know. It was like a recall, but I never. Seven dollars? I'm still waiting for Kia. Oh, yeah. How much it's supposed gonna to get take with a while. That? Um, they say you can get up to like sixty-two hundred, oh. and you best believe I'm coming for that sixty-two hundred. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> you could probably get the full amount. Yeah. yeah. That's a lot. That's you can buy a whole Toyota. new Kia with that. Yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Damn, that'd be I don't a think you want to buy another kill. No. <laughs> if they if they hit you up and was like, hey, you want to be a brand ambassador? Would you do it for like tons of money? Yeah, if I can crash the car, <laughs> then you have to agree to say that the whole story was fake. Fuck no. <laughs> the story was fabricated. Yeah, it didn't it happen. Wild. I just misplaced my keys. Yeah, <laughs> like crash every car into this wall real quick, then we have a fun <laughs> deal. Oh man, I thought you liked money. So every single time Bart recounts his like experience, in the, do you know who Bart is? Yeah, we were talking about him she earlier. She told yeah. me a little bit. Okay, um, every time he recounts his stories about the military, he always has to talk about how many like dicks he's seen. Yeah, he yeah. saw a lot of dick. <laughs> so what kind of stories you got, dude? <laughs> so what you got? How many SD cards you have? <laughs> how many portraits have you done? Yeah. I mean, I feel like the grunts 
it's probably a lot worse. Like if you're a grunt, you probably see a lot of swinging dicks. Yeah. Um, what is a grunt again? You mentioned that twice now, and I tried to pretend like I knew what that was the first time. Bro, thing, we but. know what grunts are, dude. Yeah, oh, we know what grunts are. Uh, Joe's asking. Yeah. <laughs> He's from Japan, so he doesn't know a bunch of our terminology. He's, He's from Japan. There's a language barrier. <laughs> grunts is basically the, the infantry part of it. Yeah. Gotcha. Oh, uh, you got that? Yeah. <laughs> Can we move on, please? <laughs> Stop holding up this conversation. Oh, Garanta. So they just have, there's like different, different, um, like, uh, I guess like grunts and different sections, they all yeah. have different personalities. Yeah, like, like we, we have a thing going yeah. between like, you have the grunts and then they call us pogues. Pogues? Yeah. Personnel other than grunts. <laughs> oh, shit. Isn't that a pretty big, like, division? Yeah, it's huge. <laughs> We support the grunt. <laughs> you're, you're not lying. The acronyms are really heavy. Oh, that's, <laughs> yeah. Yeah. that's tight. What else? What else is there? Just those two? Grunts and pogues. Grunts and pogues. Oh. Grunts and pogues. So then it's what's what's in the pogues crew? Like yeah. the supplies. Yeah. The you have supply, communication. You have calm. You have, you know, you have the cooks. You know, oh, the yeah. essentials. So, so the the, the po they're not. What'd you say? Was Bart calm? Because didn't he say he had to just keep calling this number and to make sure it worked? Yeah, he was like guarding. He was guarding like graveyards or something, wasn't yeah. he? <laughs> he would just be like, "Hello, yes, the phone works." <laughs> <laughs> this line is clear. Yeah. And he hang up. That's what he said his job was. So like, yeah, this is a sick ass job. <laughs> but he never said he was a pogue. Yeah. All right, we're gonna we're gonna surprise him on that. Yeah, he's a pogue. <laughs> yeah. I don't think Bart was in the military, dude. I'm starting yeah, to I'm question his stories. Pogue. I've never heard him mention pogues at all. I never heard that either. Yep. So at the, how did you transition to becoming a photographer? Because if you you were doing it um, mainly as a hobby, how did you know that you wanted that to be your thing? Because uh, I was just spending so much time on it. Like every single like second that I had that I was away from the military was yeah. just solely focused on photography. But you weren't doing it prior to the military at all. No, not at all. Oh wow. Are you the leaves kind of photographer or like product or butt cheeks kind yeah, yeah, yeah. leaves <laughs> like so, when they when they drizzle yeah, leaves yeah. and shit <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> so uh i've actually done like try to do like every single aspect of photography so I, i've done the leaves stuff yeah, i've yeah. done the butt <laughs> the stuff, leaf stuff. <laughs> <laughs> you know um and especially in la when i first got here it was just all like butt stuff butt, butt stuff it's sexual stuff Move it. lingerie yeah, yeah. yeah. It, 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 it was that stuff you know just to try and build up yeah. Just everything, yeah. yeah. kind of like how all the filmmakers do either student stuff or uh, uh, wedding stuff. Yeah, <laughs> and wedding they, stuff. they all do wedding <laughs> stuff. Oof, never got into that one. Yeah, I don't really like weddings. I almost actually lost the wedding ring on one of my photos. <laughs> I had a crazy. You lost it. Probably one of the worst photo shoots I've ever had in my life. What? Like because of no, I almost lost it. Oh god! So it, it oh, say, say that you lost it. It's yes. a way better yeah. story. Yeah, this is a good story. So, I had a photo shoot in North Carolina, right? One of my uh, old master gunnery sergeants, very high up in the military, um, <clears throat> he had called me out to go shoot his wedding, and I was like, yeah, yeah, I'll do it. So it flew me from you know California, yeah. North Carolina, stayed at my friend's house, um, and I had to drive out to this place in North Carolina on the beach to shoot the wedding. Well, I didn't have a vehicle, so I took my, my boy's bike. I do have a motorcycle license. Nice. Um, so I knew exactly where the place was, put it in on my phone, put the phone on the little holder for the motorcycle. I'm taking off, got my headset on, my AirPods. I'm driving. Next thing you know, my music cuts off, and I'm like, wait, what the, what the, the hell happened phone? Oh, no. I look down at my oh. phone. Oh, no. Fell off on the highway. Oh, no. <clears throat> so now I'm like, damn, I don't even know how to, you know, I don't have directions to the location of the wedding anymore. I'm about to be late now. So I circle back. I'm trying to look for my phone. I don't find my phone. <clears throat> the only thing I remember is the, the my master gunner sergeant saying that they're having a wedding on the beach. It was at the wedding? It yeah, wasn't a wedding it was the day of the wedding. Shoot. Yeah, it was a wedding photo shoot. I thought it was like a wedding. So I didn't know, like... I didn't know how to get there. So I just knew the general area of where it was. So then I started driving, started driving, 
And then uh, I pull over at this gas station. I was like, hey, do you know where uh, Swansboro is? Can you direct me that way? And they're like, yeah, if you just keep going straight over the bridge, you'll hit Swansboro. So I start driving over to Swansboro, <clears throat> get into there. And I'm looking for, like, I go towards the beach and I'm looking for like houses on the beach. Well, I end up finding like this little like cottage type hotel deal. I end up walking in and uh, this lady was on the phone and she was just like, oh, just wait a second. I was like, okay. So I ended up waiting. <clears throat> she got off the phone. She comes over and said, oh, can I help you? I'm like, yeah, hey, I ended up losing my phone. I need to shoot a wedding. I know it's within this area. Is there any weddings that are shot on the beach over here? And they're like, oh yeah, there's a, there's actually a wedding uh, venue place over here. She's like, yeah, there's like five of them. <laughs> <laughs> so oh, I ended no. up heading to that venue spot <clears throat> and it just so happened to be the exact place I was gonna shoot. Nice. So I was like, oh. yes, <laughs> freaking now I'm about to have a great day. Got here on time, you know, I don't give a fuck about my phone right now. <clears throat> oh, wow. So then uh, I take the rings and you know, I'm gonna go around and go shoot on the beach with the rings. So then I take them out to the beach in the sand, then I put them on the, like the oh, table, <laughs> shooting them. Oh, I put it on this little wooden log, I'm starting to shoot them. And then I'm starting to walk back to the... Uh, <laughs> Without the rings. <laughs> no, I'm starting to walk back to go give them the rings. And uh, I bumped the table and the bride's wedding ring falls in the sand and I could not find it Bro. whatsoever. Could not find it. So I'm sitting here Good like Lord, trying dude. to fish through yeah. the sand. First the, the phone and now the, the, the wedding, wedding rings. Yeah. That's how I lost my ring, bro. But then you see like a dude with one of those like magnetic beach finders. You're Dog. Like, quickly, quickly, please, please help. Oh my God. So. Dude. Now, so I'm sitting here like digging, 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 trying to find this, uh, this ring, right? And I'm like shitting bricks right now. <laughs> but it's my old master gunner, so I know how crazy he is too, so like I don't want to piss him off. And then so uh, I don't even tell them that I lost the rings. I go up to uh, the owner of the, the beach house that we were at, and I was like, ma'am, I, does this happen at all? I was like, I just lost the wedding rings in the sand. <laughs> and she's like, okay, don't panic. This does happen. As long as you know the general area, like, we'll be fine. And I was like, uh, all right. Oh, so we end up going out there and she's like, okay, where did you exactly drop it at? And I was like, I dropped it within like this little area. It has to be over here. And she's like, okay, calm down. She's like, when you go into the sand, make sure you, you come at an angle and just rise up like oh, slowly. She's He's probably like going like this yeah, and it's yeah, burying yeah. her further. <laughs> I made that mistake. I made that same mistake. Been there, done that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So we just kept doing that, kept doing that, and then she's the one that pulled it out of the sand. Nice. And I was like, yes! You're That's a good, calm yeah, way to handle that. Home. I would have been like, fuck! Ah! I would have been like, yeah! I would have walked into the ocean, dude, and just, just never come out. <laughs> he was just covering the sand. <laughs> Holy yeah. shit. We ended up finding cool, it, yeah. and then, you know, we never talked about it. They don't even know about it, nothing like that. And then, and this allegedly happened. We don't know if this is oh, not a real story. Exactly. This is a this is a fun, fake story. Hey, that'd be tight if you found a better ring. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, damn. What do you do with that? <laughs> Listen, I Holy lost shit, ring, five carrots? But I found <laughs> this. <laughs> but just imagine, though, like, I'm sitting here shooting your wedding, and I lose oh God, the I, bride's wedding ring. Like, crazy. oh man. So they didn't that know that crazy. you almost could have missed the whole thing and you almost could have ruined the whole thing. Yeah, they did. <laughs> was that the first wedding you shot? That was the first wedding I shot without my younger brother. Cause my younger brother, he does video too. And uh, I normally would just only shoot with him. And that was the first time I did it by myself and that was the last time I did it by myself. Yeah. Is your younger brother the one that always makes sure that things don't get lost? <laughs> yeah, he's actually pretty good at that. <laughs> That's his skill set, yeah. Afterwards, did, did you go back to the highway and try to find your phone? <laughs> So what ended up happening? So my phone, I, I drove the motorcycle back to uh, oh my, my friend's God. house, yeah, 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 yeah. and then uh, he was like <laughs> sleeping, and then I took his phone, and then used to find my iPhone, and then found it in the oh. road.
Yeah. So it's still a, a really lucky day. Bro. Yeah. Yeah. Nothing but net. That's Nothing awesome. Nothing but net. <laughs> That's <laughs> awesome, bro. Exactly. Holy shit. Exactly. Yeah. Holy shit, man. So that was my wedding story. You're like the most <laughs> unlucky, lucky guy. Yeah. yeah. That's such yeah. a, honestly, that's the best call to be like, find a person who maybe has done this before at a wedding where the ring is lost oh, and then ask them what to do. It's like that's mm -hmm. such a, like yeah, most guys wouldn't do like, that. Yeah. <laughs> she, you know, it's, she owns the beach house. She hosts weddings there. So yeah, I like, can't be the first one. Right, right. You know? Like nobody's going to handle that better than her. Yeah. You asking for directions for the beach is another fucking thing that most people wouldn't do. Exactly. <laughs> oh, yeah. the lady so actually sensible. printed me out like directions from MapQuest, dude. Whoa! Oh, I was gonna say MapQuest yeah. is a what joke, is but, <laughs> yeah, but it turned out to be MapQuest. Yeah. MapQuest. Yeah. Map 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 <laughs> she yeah. typed in Ask Jeeves first. <laughs> She's like, Ask Jeeves to MapQuest.com. <laughs> <laughs> You're like, wow. you got a fax machine, all of a sudden it's like, Damn, dude. <laughs> That's nice, man. And then when did you get into doing like the photography that you do like now, like, yeah, like professional, like all these like, cause I looked up his, it's actually really fucking good. <laughs> yeah. So is he like the landscape with the waterfall kind? Or the bikini kind? Or like the Bob Ross kind? <laughs> or the, I mean, he's the full portfolio kind. kind. Oh, that's cool. Oh. Like high fashion. Yeah. Oh, model. Sure. Like it's not a, they say a guy that's doing a hobby. <laughs> 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 it's good. <laughs> it's actually good. Who are some uh, <clears throat> like clients that you're proud of having shot? Um, uh, Dua Lipa was pretty cool. Um, shot Little Kim. Um, uh, Yo Gotti and Angela Simmons, they've been like really good, really wow. good clients and That's very tight. consistent with them. Um, I've shot with uh, Black China, Jeffree Star was very dope to shoot with. He was Every time he says this, we should get the actual photos that he did, it'll yeah. pop up. Boop, boop, oh, yeah. Boop. Yeah, yeah, that'd be sure. cool. Yeah. It's just photos from other photographers. <laughs> 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 it's gotta be his photos that he did. Every time he says this is just another wedding ring. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So, um. That's tight, man. Yeah, I got into that by, uh, like, once I found out I was gonna be, um, moving out here, I just hit up every single model that I can find. Nice. And was like, hey, can, can we shoot? Can we shoot? Can we shoot? Can we shoot? That's how you do um, it. She yeah. was one of my LA stops that I ended up uh, doing. Mm -hmm. Yeah, first person I met out here in LA, and then I saw his work before it was where it's at now. Oh, and I was yeah, like, me, like, "You need to get to LA and hone so you your skills." Skill and you I was like, like, "Get out here, you'll make money." That's tight. That's tight. Yeah. Did you ever post the photos that he took of you? Yeah. On your stuff? Yeah, yeah. Was it the butt uh, stuff? Uh, it was the butt stuff. Yeah. <laughs> the butt the stuff. stuff. Long the butt stuff. stuff. <laughs> it's just a butt. Every JK fan is like, "Where's the butt stuff?" <laughs> yeah, send him a link. Colleen will send you a link. Yeah. yeah, but there's gonna be a paywall. Well, don't worry. Yeah, yeah. We'll, we'll, we'll put photos up here. And guess what? It's gonna be my button instead. Yeah. 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 You keep swiping. You're like, oh, I'm almost but, there, and it's Nick, and like, you're like, ah. Oh! Joe Not will even. do a shoot with you after. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Jokes on you. Some people will like that better. <laughs> True. No, it's not a joke on me, dude. It's not a joke on me. <laughs> <laughs> That's tight, though. Those are some really good uh, clients, man. That's dope. Yeah, I feel like. Uh, so yeah, after like oh, getting in touch with all models, I figured out like models weren't the way to go. Mm -hmm. um, really? Why is that? Uh, it's just because the models they kind of want to like kind of hold you for themselves sometimes oh, really? or. You don't get as because your photos are so variety. good that they love you. Or... Yeah, yeah, kind of. And they please take like... all my photos. Well, yeah. they, they also don't want you to work with other people <laughs> they're competing with, right? Is it because of the the your style? They want <laughs> that to match theirs, and then they don't want other people to have your style. In, in a way, that but also way. these models are gonna get hired off of good photos too. Wow. It's a representation of their work as well, right? So if they find That's a good true. photographer, yeah. they're gonna want to keep them. But I feel like the the hidden gems are the lie within the, the, makeup, the makeup artist, the hairstylist, and the stylist. Mm. All my biggest True. jobs have come from. Oh, because they'll recommend. Ooh, yeah. yeah. I got yeah. Jeffree Star through a hairstylist. I got uh, a shot with Black Gina through a makeup artist. And then I got uh, Angela Simmons and Yo Gotti through a uh, clothing stylist. Wow. That's cool. People looking out, man. Those are mm -hmm. big fucking names, man. Yeah. So. That means you must be really good to work with. Yeah, seriously. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Definitely like to give, like, yeah. you know, try to stay as professional as possible. You don't ask for autographs? Good workflow. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. 
You don't ask for a feature? <laughs> Yo, got it, bro. Move me on a fucking side. I would have used that. Hey, here's my mixtape. Yo, like, I'm a photographer. I'm doing this on the side, but, you know, I'm trying to like it. Hey, you listen to hip hop? <laughs> He's like, uh, what? <laughs> I respect that. Yeah, that's a good angle. Holy shit. In the middle of shooting, hey, you look like someone that likes, likes rap. <laughs> or you're like, hey, this photo would be better with some headphones. <laughs> 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 Oh, what do you think? Yeah, what do you Dude, I'm just put something on for ambiance. <laughs> oh shit, this song's pretty good, don't you think? <laughs> Ten years in the Marines. <laughs> oh, who's that? <laughs> Holy shit, it's kind of a cool flow. Yeah. Dope story, whoever this is. <laughs> I'm just gonna put on some music for some moods, you know? We're good at expanding um, business. That's something you want to try out. Just try it out and yeah. see, what, see what the feedback is. Solid suggestions <laughs> yeah, here at JK News. <laughs> And that's your, so like in photography, you've done so much already. What's something that you haven't done yet in photography that is like one of your goals? Um, hmm. um probably just owning my own studio. Mm. I feel like, um, like right now, uh, one of my friends, um, he owns a uh, 503 um, studios. It's, uh, he owns like multiple studios that like around. In downtown? Downtown LA, Orange County, and stuff like oh, that. Nice. Um, so he lets me shoot in like those locations when I just want to create. So very thankful to have him. Um, and then my clients, wherever they get studios and stuff like that. But that's yeah. probably the only thing is just probably just owning a studio for myself. Just for so your I can space. Just build yeah. it out the way I want and stuff like that. Oh yeah. Um, and then uh, probably just pick up more sponsorships. Nice. Who's your dream uh, company you want to? Could grab as a sponsor. Sony. Yeah. I would love to just get a sponsorship by Sony. You're so free. You know? Can't wear gear. Uh, I got Westcott. Um, oh, nice. Uh, I was able to get sponsored by them. Uh, so all your lights photos. are covered then. That's oh, cool. Yeah. yeah. Nice. Yeah. My lights are covered. Uh, very good customer service. Um, I got them through shooting the uh, George Floyd uh, protest. Oh, yeah. I saw that so on, your, on your page. Yeah. I went out there, shot a whole bunch of like black and white photos, mm -hmm. and uh, mm -hmm. they really enjoyed that. And that kind of like solidified everything for me. Nice. How about uh, Aperture? Want Aperture the sponsor? Um, I mean, I wouldn't, I wouldn't mind. I do love what Scott when it comes to lighting, though. Oh, right. Because... Aperture leans a little more video. Oh. Okay. How about Ross? <laughs> yeah, what about Ross? Like, dress for less? <laughs> <laughs> What, what, what's your stance on their sponsorship? Oh, okay. <laughs> you want a sponsor? Yeah, <laughs> Love you guys' socks. <laughs> what if that's a conflict with Sony somehow? <laughs> They're like, hey, you can work with Canon, but not Ross. Dude. So are you fuck gonna be Ross? <laughs> If you guys want to check out Joseph's photography, the link is going to be in the info below. So yeah, please go support. It's it's really amazing photography. And also, if you want to get to know him more as a person, yep. DM him and then hit yeah. on him and yeah. stuff. Hit on him. Yeah. Yeah. Are you single? Are you single, by the way? Yeah. Uh, right now, yes, I am. Ladies. Blow it up. Yeah. Blow it up. Or gentlemen. <laughs> Give up. Nick a rest. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah get to, go get some butt pics. Yeah, send some butt pics to Joseph. Go check out the leaves, waterfalls, cars, but <laughs> <laughs>